my dear sisters and brothers welcome back to the wa the word of promise program where we are going to do the second reading for the day a reading from the letter of st paul to the philippians brothers and sisters i know how to live in humble circumstances i know also how to live with abundance in every circumstance and in all things i have learned the secret of being well fed and of going hungry of living in abundance and of being in need i can do all things in him who strengthens me still it was kind of you to share in my distress my god will fully supply whatever you need in accord with his glorious riches in Christ Jesus to our God and Father glory forever and ever amen father what is the lord teaching us today through the letter of st paul yeah so we know uh, when we gather up the readings for a particular sunday the second reading is for further edification and uh, but then uh, i have found it always to have a bearing on the message uh, in a in the in the second generation of uh, uh, christianity right so what we are learning is from the old testament which is from the first reading and usually and then from the gospel which is the the first disciples community and the next community the first christian community and how the message that is being discussed in the main readings first and the gospel is being reflected in the community uh, is what we have in the second reading uh, more more or less uh, more often and today i i find a beautiful answer to the question that you asked earlier in this reading okay. so you are saying so we don't need to stay until uh, no until we die to uh, experience that banquet and we have a person who experience that beauty the joy of the banquet every day even when he don't have anything even uh, when he has everything mm. so both is here i know how to live uh, in humble circumstances i know also how to live with abundance and uh, when you don't have anything when there is many more things or very little things because i can do all things in him who strengthens me so christ gives you that support now we have a person who is in that banquet mm. who has that joy who experience that cup overflowing uh, the anointment of the lord uh, where the, all the uh, no crowds of onlookers would look at this guy and envies him for the graces that he has Uh, been given and he is living the life eternal on earth so we have a, a very beautiful character and a, a proof mm. of what the, what we are been discussing mm. thank you so much father thank you so much my dear sisters and brothers let's listen to a small message from bobo 